another giant. Hey, it's Matt. It's uh, September 21st, 2017. I'm here at the lake we call Bass Mecca. Uh, we were here last week. We killed it. I boated 12 fish. Had two more uh, nice ones to get off at the boat. 88 degrees. It's a little warm here in Michigan for late September, but the leaves are falling. They're turning. The days are getting shorter, and these bass are feeding up. So we're going to go out here and see what we can do. Uh, weather called for calm winds and no rain. It's windy and it's raining, so we're just going to see how it goes. Uh, last week did all my damage on a half ounce Buckeye mop jig. This week we're going to upsize it to a 5 8. So when we're looking for some different fishing spots, I want to get deep and cover water. Alright, see you out there. Alright, we made it down to the water. Rain. Rain pretty good on the way down, but it seems to be kind of holding off. Hopefully, hopefully it's moving on. All right, this rain's kicking up again. Uh, we're probably going to hold off for a few minutes here. my better judgment I came out here first fish of the day uh, put him on the scale he's pretty big oh boy we got that hook hook in him good alright oh boy We've got 21 inches. Quick weight on them. We got a break in the rain. Let's set the camera back up. All right, these, these downpours are killing me. I've got holes in my case, so I can't leave it up there. Just got a hold of fish number two. Another giant. All right. Right in the top of the mouth, buried in there. When, this, when you do get a good hookup with this jig, it's, it's phenomenal. Not coming off. Alright. Fish feels a little heavier. We are at 20, 20 and a half. On our little fishing circle, when we catch two 20s in one night, we call it bass gloves. They got mouths so big, you could wear them like a glove. Well, this guy feels a little heavier. Now I'd like to get a bona fide five pounder for the year. I'd like to get a six pounder, but we'll start with a five. 
So let's get them on the scale real quick here. There we go. He is heavy. Oh, there we go. I don't know if you can see that. 5.04. That is 5.04. That is a five pounder. Nice fish. Nice fish. Alright, so here's the deal. This area has been producing like crazy. It produced uh, like crazy last Friday when we came out here. My buddy Kyle is in the parking lot with my buddy Justin. This weather is iffy. I guess there might be more heavy stuff coming. I don't know how long I'm going to get out here. I don't know if they're going to get out here at all. Hunting season's coming. Fishing time is limited. I wanted to save the spot for uh, so, so Kyle could get into some nice fish, but I'm just keep fishing and see what happens. All right, rain seems to have settled down. I still still hear thunder rumbling in the distance. Uh, we're gonna give this a shot. Uh, while you're away, I got a 17 and a half and a 16 and a half. But I'd like to do a lot better than that uh, if we're going to get a good score tonight. Another good fish. That might touch 20, which would be three 20s in one night. That'd be pretty wild. Yeah, he wasn't going anywhere. And he came up and got it as I was reeling it in. Definitely some fish suspended in here. Four two two. Another nice one. Off he goes. That's uh, that's three over twenty 
fish in about an hour. Uh, I've never, never come close to scoring 100 points before. Uh, so I'm going to keep pressing here. That would be pretty special. As you can see, there's a bald eagle flying in front of us. That's pretty neat. Feels like a decent one here. This is gonna help. This is gonna help. Oh boy. Holy cow. Alright. That was a good lesson on uh, leaving too much line out. We got him. He was hooked good. Uh, almost lost the net. There he is. That's a nice fish. It may not go 20, but that's that's gonna that's gonna help. That is just shy of 20. We can't get 20 out of them. But we can definitely get 19.75 out of them. That's a nice, another nice fish. So these last two have kind of come out a little farther than I was catching them the other day. So clearly there's more to this area. Well guys, looks like Kyle and Justin are here. Uh, I'm going to have some explaining to do for uh, not saving the spot for Kyle. But at this point, I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and I'll go ahead and risk it. Uh, this is one of the better fishing nights I've ever had. My last 20 came from out in here, and they're all scattered all, all through this area. I'm going to be bummed if these fish just don't bite the rest of the night. That is going to be not cool. Oh, no. Oh, no, he's still on there. He's still on there. He's still, oh, boy. All right. All right. Oh, this might be 100 points, Kyle.
All right, we'll see what we've got here. I haven't done the math, but I'm thinking anything over 18, 18 and a half is probably going to put us at 100. And that, ladies and gentlemen, that's 19. Right on the 19, and I can't quite get 19 and a quarter out of him, but he's a solid 19. Right there. All right, we're going to do some quick math here. And if we truly hit 100 points, we're going to leave this area for Kyle. I have three, three twenty. So we've got that nineteen plus the nineteen seven five. Twenty point five. Twenty point five and twenty one puts us at one hundred point seven five. Oh my. I guess they're on the edges too. I don't know. That's a good fish. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. That is my fourth 20 inch fish, Kyle. Oh yeah. You got twenty and three quarter.
four six five.